off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Hey friends, welcome. I wanted to show you what I got for my sister's baby shower. Um, I have to be very cautious when I film around this sister. I don't have permission to do so. <laughs> so I, um, you won't see as much of the baby shower, also because I want to be there and enjoying it myself. But you won't see my sister at all. Um, but I will try and show like the cute gifts and the decorations and, and all that kind of stuff and like my perspective of the baby shower and probably my other two sisters because they don't mind being on camera. Um, so I just wanted to show you all the things that we have gotten so far. I am not sure about the group gift um, items. I'm trying to get a final count from the guests on it, if anyone is contributing to that. If so far no one is, so I might, and this might be it. Um, I also need to, based on that, will depend on how much more I do. I might do diapers wipes in conjunction with a group gift. If not, um, I'm gonna have to figure that out. So let me just show you really quick the few things that I have gotten for her. Um, I have had each of my girls buy her something for the baby, I should say, buy the baby something. Um, just to make it more personalized. So they have each picked something out. I actually just picked um, something out for Kaylee. I showed her picture, pictures of a few things at Marshall's. I just barely got back. Um, and she said yes to the one I just got because she's just busy, has to work today and yada yada. I also picked up a door hanger for our bathroom. And I'm actually gonna label each of those little hooks so we know which towel is ours. Battery's flashing, hold. All right, I've got you propped up here. Um, so this is the outfit Kaylee just picked out and it has little trucks on it with a little truck right there, or little tractor I should say. I just thought it was so cute. And I love the little vest. I kind of wish it had a hoodie, um, but I just, I loved it. And it's got like gray pants to go with it. It's a size zero to three. I kind of try to pick things in a few different set size ranges in order to kind of have just you know a variety of new things at different stages in life and then i also just picked this up so cute i love soft cozy blankets obviously it's not a swaddle blanket but i love like cozying babies up like laying them on the bed um, and laying them on cozy blankets like this and then they usually are you know swaddled up or have a blanket over them. So I got, got that one, super cute. We'll just do Ashley's first. We'll just go top to bottom. This is the one Ashley picked out. This one's from Target. So cute. My sister and her husband really love Disneyland slash Disney World. And so I got this one for that. Has a little Mickey and Minnie on the sleeve. Very cute very cozy she's due in october so we've got cold months for a long time <laughs> especially given the utah weather oh like last winter was absolutely snowbound so they're gonna have snowy weather for quite a while okay i have two pieces for my next for mine so i have to like kind of divide them up here okay this one is what abby picked out love corduroy and I'm totally digging the rust color. So she picked this one out and it has like little dinosaurs on it. Super cute. I love that one. And then Chelsea picked out this guy, Roar. And then the pants have little lions. I guess we have like all like animals. <laughs> I don't know. I just loved the colors on this one. I mean, Chelsea did too. She she wanted to have animals on hers. So that one is the one Chelsea is going to give her. And then I have this cute little uh, crew neck. Super cute. I put a onesie underneath it. 
And then look at these little bubble pants. I love pants like this because they're big, you know, they're big diaper butt. <laughs> so cute. So there's the little outfit for this one here. And then that says heartbreaker, right? No, it says loved. This one says loved. And then I also got this shirt to go with the pants. See how it's got the same gray. These ones are all from Target. So these guys, and yeah, all the rest of these are all from Target and the Mickey Mouse one. They're all from Target. So then now, because this is going to be after the fact, I can show you the decor slash gift bags. We are having this event at Olive Garden. <laughs> Just because I'm coming from out of town, my sister's coming from out of town, both of my sisters are coming from out of town, and my dad's whole basement has flooded, and so we don't really have a place to like host it at, and so, <laughs> and I didn't want to put that burden on my sister-in-laws, they both work full-time, my brothers both work full-time, and so I didn't want to put that onto them to like host, and then to have to come into town and quickly decorate. So we're just doing it easy. Second baby, we're gonna go easy. Let me show you the decoration, so. All right, the first thing that I have is this cute little little baby sign. I'm hoping that we have like a large table that I can like tape that to. In fact, I should go grab my tape. So I can just tape it to a table um, and have that draping over it. Then, because we're gonna serve um, dessert at Olive Garden after we all eat lunch, um, I wanted to have our own napkins and plates to serve the cake on so we don't have to waste the restaurants, like dishes and whatnot. Um, and then I wasn't sure, our, our number count went up, and I wasn't sure how many plates were in these packs. <laughs> There's 24 in each of these. We have plenty of plates. But I went back to the dollar store yesterday and I got some more. I got two more 12 packs. So we have lots, but I can actually use these plates for the family dinner that we're having at my dad's house immediately following the baby shower. I'm also in charge of that. It's kind of a big weekend, but it's okay. And then the all the baby gifts, and actually I need to count up. There's four, five, six, possibly seven. I need to go get more gift bags. <laughs> the problem is I have only found this style of gift bags at the dollar store that Ashley and I went to that was like way out of town. And I have looked at our dollar store since then and I haven't found them. So I just have brown ones to kind of be as like a neutral color. Um, but then I have this one is like the main one. Isn't that so cute? Welcome little one and this little elephant. And then this one here. Hello little baby. So cute. That side is kind of the same thing. And then this is my favorite. Isn't that so cute? Look at the little elephant and the little balloon. This is new baby. I really want some more of these, but I think maybe um, tonight I'm gonna go to the dollar store um, while Ashley is at Cheer um, and double check and see if they have anything else that will coordinate with these. Um, Cause now I need, there's five. I technically could probably put all of my gifts into one bag because the blanket is big. Hey Keely. Hi. But I'm using the bag as the decoration because I like the decor along with like these just to like add to the bag. We'll just tape it to the bag because I need it to be simple. I'm having to travel with it all out of town and I don't want to like do a big hoopla at Olive Garden. <laughs> And so I just have to be very minimal with what I have and what I take. I was also able to find these cute little burp towels um, at church. We went through some of our cupboards <laughs> and someone had made these for a humanitarian service project and probably last year and they hadn't been able to donate all of them. And they're all hand stitched, um, not hand stitched, like all handmade um, little burp towels. And they were like, just take these and use them for your sister. So they were like, you take these for your sister. So I think that is it. Um, let me find, show you one fun thing I got from my aunt. 
I'm so excited to give it to her. She knows that I have it. Um, she is the aunt, my aunt and uncle, that Jason and I spent time with in Hawaii last year when we went alone. And we were able to go to Duke's and have lunch with them. And then we went back to their condo and we hung out with them. And then I think we did one other thing with them. Um, but we both have a deep love of Maui. I actually want to buy her timeshare. <laughs> she wants to sell it. I want to buy her timeshare. Um, anyway, so I'm taking this for her because she couldn't find it at her Costco. And then I've got all this stuff that I think I showed you yesterday that is for my other sister who just graduated. And then um, my other aunt, it's all a surprise that all of my aunts are coming. <laughs> um, and my other aunt um, need, desperately needs some slides. And so Jason let me bring two sizes home for her to try on, and then we'll just bring the extra one home. It's just the plus side of owning the store yourself so we can like help family get shoes. And now I have to box all this up. I've been trying to get Jason to bring me a box home from the store, but he doesn't have one. And I don't want the gift bags, it's like this stack right here. Like I don't want the gift bags to get bent. And so I'm hoping, I actually have an Amazon package. You guys, <laughs> I can't wait. I, I have an hour before my Amazon package is supposed to be here. I'm going to show you because it's gonna be after the effect. So I have a package coming. One, it's a bra, and then the other thing is a game that we're gonna play at my family dinner. So in my family, there's eight siblings and then my dad. Um, my mom passed away two years ago. And since she's passed away, we've tried to instigate family dinners every single month, and a new person is in charge of that month um, so that you don't have to do it but every, what would it be, nine months? <laughs> we try and like make it through the whole year, like everyone has a month for the year, and then there's kind of like a few months where they, where it doesn't really count, like Christmas and Thanksgiving, because you know, you're just gonna do that as a family anyway. So I haven't been able to do it because we didn't go down there this summer, and so Kaylee, can I tell you what game I, I got to play with the family uh -oh. on Saturday? <laughs> Oh gosh, I have to just, I have to tell Kaylee what it is, but I'm gonna t tell you guys what it is as soon as the package comes in the mail, because it'll be way funnier if you guys just see it, and then I explain to you what game we're gonna play. All right, all of this stuff is kind of thrown up on the counter now, <laughs> but I'm really hoping the box that's coming is gonna fit everything. But I also, I mean, you can't tell how good these are. So these are the cookies Abby made last night with my caramel chocolate, my ca caramel chips and chocolate chips. You guys, you can't really even see the caramel chips in here because they kind of just blend in. But when you get a bite of the caramel, oh my goodness sakes, it's so good. It is so good. I'm gonna have one. I had one this morning because I couldn't resist. I didn't get to see them. I didn't get to eat them last night. I'm gonna warm it up just a smidge and uh, see what it tastes like. I really wanted to have one last night. Anyone's microwave makes sounds like that? So annoying, but it doesn't always do it. Just like when I have a camera on or when there's a TV show on. I wanted to have a cookie last night. She made them hot and I, was, I had just finished watching my shows and brushed my teeth when she pulled the first batch out of the oven. And I was like, don't eat, it's 10 o'clock at night. <laughs> Just go to bed. I do not need the sugar at that late a time. I don't need it now, but oh, the caramel chips, they're salted caramel with the chocolate. So good, so good. Okay, it came and I gotta hurry. <laughs> It's gonna be so fun. Ashley's here, she's home from school. We gotta go to cheer. Okay, there were so this is the game. It's it's called, um, For what? Hide and, we'll tag. The person who's it has to be blindfolded and then everyone else duct tapes these to your feet. Oh. And so you, you, t you duct tape it to your heel. Yeah. I'll show you. <laughs> yep, you duct tape it to your heel. Please, never mind, I need to be duct taped. Okay, yeah. And then you try and tiptoe around, and then, <laughs> but if you step on it, the person's gonna hear you. The funny thing is, step on it, it doesn't, but when you, 
when you release it. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> okay, no, no, no. But we got. Stop. Put it back in. <laughs> Stop. This should get us these. Put them in. Put them in. No. Put it in. It's a stress reliever. They're a little. They're a little smaller than I thought they were gonna be. Yeah. Um, Except that's the perfect. Size. But it's actually the perfect size for your, you know, your shoes. So the funny thing is that when you have like 10, 20 people playing, kids, adults, <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be a lot of squeaking, and then <laughs> it sound like what I just did, but millions of other. Yeah, by by like you know. And then they use like a twenty four, and then they like. No, you just have to tag me. Yeah, you just have no, to. you don't. You just have to touch the person. No, you're blindfolded. Yeah, you're blindfolded and, and you touch you, them. You're, no, yeah. Yeah, you except have to for, touch the person. Except for if when the tiger, not the tiger, but like the blindfolded person yeah. hears a sound, they turn they back like, yeah. and try and... And try and tag you. And then you're out, and then it's the last person standing that wins. That I should have a prize, but I don't. I don't I haven't thought about that yet. Know. Maybe I'll just go buy a bunch of candy bars. I don't want them to melt my car right now on the drive there, so... I don't know. I don't know if we need to have a prize. I think the laughter is enough of a prize. All right, I just dropped Ashley off at her other cheer squad. They start tonight. She has two squads plus tumbling tonight. And then, sorry, you're in the truck. Can. And then um, she starts her competitive squad next week. But I am getting my shoes on. It's not as warm as it said it was going to be right now, or sunny. But I am. I'm going to start my whole section of walking for as many of the four hours as I can. So wish me luck today. Wish me luck that it doesn't start to rain. You guys, look at that. Those don't look like good clouds but then it's blue skies over there. So I'm hoping the sun comes my way. All right, we're both tired girls, right? She just did her four hour cheer and on her two squads plus tumbling class, correct? I just, yeah, I just got 340, 3, no, 3,411 3, just from one cheer class. Yep, she's been checking her steps. Because Dad I forgot his watch today. Well, he didn't. I asked him to forget it. Oh, he, you did? Yeah. Um, so she's tracked her steps. I actually walked for the first two and a half hours that she was in practice. Um, almost three hours. Um, and I got four miles in walking and then... Um, I would have gotten like five miles. But I, I did six it. miles for the day. Are so I did pretty now? good. Yes, I, it's over there. This girl's hungry, so we're gonna go get her some Panda Express. It's the only chicken she'll eat, um, and I'm hungry too. Jason was gonna make me dinner, and he's like, go get yourselves some Panda Express. It's eight o'clock. But we're gonna end it with you guys tonight. Um, I'm going to finish up packing tomorrow, and Jason and I are gonna head out. It'll be hey, quite fun. Head. Not yeah. tomorrow, Not we're not leaving tomorrow, but I've gotta do my final. Are Final coming, packing. Are you coming back on Monday or leaving on Monday? Well, I don't want to give away the details because that's too far in advance. <laughs> we'll talk about when I'm coming back. When I'm coming back. I know I was going to tell you something else. Now I can't remember what. All right. Well, we're stuck in traffic now. I didn't think there'd be traffic at 8 o'clock at night, but... Um, it's just a car. Oh. Well, we're just on a one-lane road, so it just is backed up. Um, oh, this is what I remembered. Um... Go, dude, go, go, quick. Holding everything up. Uh, so tonight I was talking to your coach right after your first squad per, like um, yeah. practiced. I know a little bit. And her, <laughs> her coach, who is the competitive squad coach, technically, she's overall all of it, but she was, so we were talking and she's like, how many squads is she on right now? And I said, we, we have about a month overlap with her other squad. And uh, so we're gonna be a little bit late to her competitive squad, but she's like, dude, just, we'll make it work, it'll be fine. And she's like, but I have a, sm a small request if she's looking for something to do as soon as she's done with that other squad. And I was like, 
what do you mean? She has four hour practices. Like what else do you want her to do? And she's like, I kind of want her to do the dance drill squad. It's because. <laughs> Why? Because they only have like 10 people. And they even oh, to really? To do a dance. She just wants to introduce her to more the dance style, which she knows that Ashley will like and she'll be good at. So we'll see. I got, we, got to, we got to pay for Christmas and Japan before I can add another squad maybe. We'll see how you do. We'll see how it goes. But I'm gonna say goodnight to you guys. Um, very tired. So we're gonna close it out and you guys have a good day too. Easy, easy on our tip -tip.